We can do the uh, rework of the F-22 inlets faster, cheaper, and better than what a human can do it. That's our goal, and I think we successfully achieved it. This technology is developed so that we can paint the inside of an inlet, which is a multi-million dollar jet. The F-22 is just now coming in for refurbishment for their inlets, and we were looking at a problem of where the number of F-22s coming in were going to increase significantly in the coming years and there was no way to expeditiously refurbish them. The F-22 looked to develop a solution for that problem, to do it faster, better, cheaper. If this technology didn't exist, we'd still be doing it the old way, which would mean you have the person putting on a Tyvek suit, crawling into a confined space, laying on their back and trying to spray this large circular tube in a consistent manner. To get the aircraft back into service is going to be five times as long. We now come in with a robot that will do it repeatable, which means we're spraying at the same thickness every time. Using our robot technology, we're able to go from approximately 1,600 hours of labor to paint these inlets to around 300 hours. So it really solves our problem in getting these aircraft back into service quicker. We expect to save the Air Force around $28 million in cost. Our organization used the Air Force SBIR program to make a process improvement in our F-22 coatings application by basically helping to develop a robotic system that has some improvements for applying coatings to the F-22 intakes. It's improved the process speed. Our coatings buildup gate used to take 36 days per jet, and so it's gone down to 24 days. We have a reduced man hours by about 1,000 man hours. It's been saving According to my estimates, about $220,000 per aircraft. Being a part of this SBR program with the Air Force really gives us a sense of pride in seeing one of the best fighter jets that the Air Force has get back into service a lot quicker. And when we see the aircraft flying overhead, knowing that we had a hand in making it what it is, uh, really gives you a sense of accomplishment.